Hello everyone, today I'll be talking about mismatches and OG mismatches. Now, a mismatch is when the mane and tail color are naturally different. Now, if you look in the stats on this horse, the mane is black and the tail is white and it's not dyed, it's naturally. Now, this is a rare breeding chance. The parents must have different hair colors for a mismatch to happen. Now, if the parents had the same hair color and you had the, you had the chance of being a mismatch, you get what's called a failed mismatch. Now, it's when the chance is low like this. But both of the parents have the same color, so you didn't get a mismatch. Now, bred mismatches aren't too hard to come across since they, they still are rare, but they're in game and you have a random chance of breeding them. Now, personally, I've actually bred five mismatches myself, including her. She's really pretty. Now, it can be ugly, pretty, whatever. But even if it's ugly, it's still going to be worth more than your normal horse. Now, some people have already heard of bred mismatches, but they do not know what an OG mismatch is because they are completely different. An OG mismatch was a mismatch that, that is purchased or bought. If you look at the stats, it's not bred, it's bought. Mm -hmm. Now, these were bought with Robux from Larry at the beginning of the game, up until January 28th, 2022. So they're very old, and a lot of people did not play during the time, which means a lot of people didn't buy them, which is why they're very rare. Now, these are way rarer than the bred ones. They're always worth a lot, even like the common ones. The most common one is... Um, this is the most common one, and even it's worth a lot. So, if you have an OG mismatch, that's cool. Tell me in the comments um, if, you, if you've ever bred a mismatch at all in general, or if you have one of these. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped. If it didn't, please comment on any questions or if you need help. Thank you for watching, and thank you.